guys happy halloween today is monday this is the week of halloween i am so excited so i thought i would just do like a week in my life take you guys along with me through everything i'm doing this week today is monday the first day of my halloween and the first thing i'm gonna do today is get my nails done so let's go do that So I just finished getting my nails done and they look so good. Just in case you didn't know, I go to Embellished by Miriam over here in Winter Park. She is the best. I only ever go to her. I trust her so much with my nails. She is so good at designs, like literally anything you want. Like if you find something on Pinterest, which is what I usually do, she will be able to do it pretty much exactly like the picture. I also have on my spooky phone case. So this is from Casetify. I'll put the link for this too. I have a discount code. You can just go to casetify.com slash emilyenchanted if you wanna save 15% off your order. This video isn't sponsored but i just thought i would let you guys know i am starving i am so hungry so let's go ahead and go to one of my favorite places ever it is called foxtail coffee it's also a store with bagel bruno so it's coffee and bagel sandwiches coffee and I got my bagel and I look outside and it's pouring rain it makes me sad because I was gonna work outside like I brought my laptop I was gonna do like a homework and eat and it was gonna be so cute but now it's raining next up on the agenda for today is I actually have to go pick up one of my friends from the airport he's landing around 2 30 and it's 1 30 so there's like a thrift store around here called Avalon Exchange I might go there when in doubt let's go thrift shopping actually found some stuff from my Halloween costume. I was not expecting that, but I'm so glad I went in. For one of my costumes, I want to be a Polly Pocket. First thing is I got this headband. This just screams Polly Pocket to me. Like, I'm thinking I'm gonna wear it like this, and then I'm gonna try to, like, hairspray and bump up my hair to add, like, volume, you know? It was five dollars. And then I found these earrings the most Polly Pocket earrings I could think of that perfectly match the headband and then I'm wearing a pink top and a pink and orange skirt that are coming in again on Wednesday from Amazon. I found this really cool ring. I just thought this one was fun. And then I got this cutie little ring. I just feel like this is like such a good almost like an anxiety ring because I noticed one of my anxiety ticks is playing with my rings. I got a Polly Pocket necklace. And then I also ended up going to Sephora. I feel like my skin has been a little dry recently. So I got the Belief Aqua Balm. I've definitely used this before. It's expensive, but it's really good. And then I also got the same brand, but their eye cream. And then I also got the Watermelon Glow Sleeping Mask. I have this project that I have to do. So I kind of think I'm just gonna do that for the rest of the day. I don't know if I'm gonna vlog anymore. So yesterday, I kind of forgot that I was vlogging. I ended up not doing my homework like I thought I was going to. And instead, I went out to dinner with a friend and then we had a spooky night. And we watched like all of the Halloween towns. It was so much fun. So my project that I really need to do, it's due on Thursday. And it's now Tuesday. So I have to do it tonight. It doesn't matter who calls me. Zach Efron could literally call me. And I'd have to be like, hey buddy, so sorry, but I actually have homework to do, okay? You guys are gonna hold me to that. So I actually have something really scary happening today. I have class. It's 12.30, I have to leave for my class at two, but before I go to class, I wanted to film a video. So today I'm filming like a spooky q and A. I I asked you guys to ask me questions. I kind of wanna wear this beanie today. What if I wore my Howie shirt? So I thought this would be like really cute and like hipster. I think the hat's a little out of my comfort zone. I'm really trying to like elevate my style and like dress differently. This just isn't me. Also, it's Florida. So I think this is gonna be what I wear today. Look how crazy I am. This is my water cup of the day and it's also like Yeehaw themed. This is the fit of the day with these brown sunglasses. Both the sunglasses and the top are Princess Polly. And I have a discount code with them. You can use my code EMILYN if you want to save 20% off your order. I get to wear my new ring that I got yesterday. So all my other rings, they're just all from Amazon. This is my ring tour. 
I wanted to put you guys on to something. I just put on my go-to lip combo and I thought I would share in case you have like a similar like skin tone, I guess, as me. So I just used the MAC Velvet Teddy lipstick and then I used the Tower 28 um, lip gloss in coconut. And then lastly, my perfume is Bath & Body Works, White Pumpkin and Chai. Well, this is fun doing a little like get ready with me for today. So I'm gonna go film my video, get some coffee, get some food, cause I'm so freaking hungry and then go to class. On full Christmas. I thought I would do a Trader Joe's haul. I got sparkling water, little baby white pumpkins. This might be the only real pumpkin that I buy this year. Avocados. I also got spiced cider, fall pasta, which is essentially just pumpkin pasta. Some Go Macro bars. These are my favorite protein bars. Six ginger shots. Cruciferous crunch. I don't know how to pronounce that. Spinach. Limeade. Their brown rice. Butternut mac and cheese. And last but not least, I got an herb tahini sauce. I pretty much was just working all morning and then I went to the gym and then now I'm actually gonna go drive to Tampa because my dad is there. He just flew in today just for like a little work trip and so I get to go see him which I'm super excited. We're gonna go get dinner so I'm about to go drive. It's like an hour and a half drive. I wanna show you guys my fit. I think you'll be proud of me. So this is my little dinner outfit. This dress is so cute. It's from Target. I'm wearing it with my white cowboy boots. This is my little Tampa fit. I'm so excited. So let's go to Tampa. So I just got back home from Tampa. Dinner was so fun. I'm so happy I got to see my dad. I was going to go to Horror Nights tonight, but I have to do my homework instead. My Amazon packages came. So let's hope this works out. So to be a Polly Pocket, I was like, I have to get platform flip flops. Just, just read um, what's in the box. Wait, this is kind of cute. I don't hate it. I just don't know if it necessarily like makes sense, but I'm gonna print out a little thing that says Polly Pocket here. Guys, today has been awful. I was up until 5 a.m. working on my project for my music class, finally finished it, and then I went to bed, and then I had to wake up at 11. Then I ended up being 15 minutes late to my class today, which today was the one day I had to come to class early because we had a quiz that we were doing that started right at three. And when I was driving to class, it was storming. Like today, I think, I'm pretty sure I was driving under a tornado watch. So I was terrified for my life. It's 8.41 and I'm getting ready for a Halloween party. So I have two friends coming over, Lexi and Josh, tonight. Oh, Lexi's here. She's gonna get ready with me. Tonight is a night that I'm gonna be a Polly Pocket. Did y'all notice my mustache is fake too? Or does it look that good? It's not fake. Is yeah, it? There's, there's much McCall on it. The eyebrow. The really? Eyebrow. eyebrow pencil? Yeah, come on now. <laughs> I really thought you just had a mustache. On, no. no. Did, no, you grew it out. <laughs> you had one though, right? I did, but I shaved like two days ago. Oh, I bought a face mustache, but it didn't stick right out the box. Okay, um, hey guys. So I'm here with Lexi and Josh, and we are all in our Halloween <laughs> costumes. So I want to show you guys our costumes and talk about what we are. You can go first. I didn't know what he was. Yeah, Emily didn't know what I am, but I'm clearly John from the Carousel of Progress. I think it's the 70s. Is it the 70s? Like I would. We're gonna say know. it's the 70s. Going downtown sure, yes. for a cold sarsaparilla with the boys. Oh, it's it's called same. root beer now. Same thing. Yay! Um, I'm Trinity from the Matrix, but I didn't feel like gelling my hair back, so there we go. Sponsored by. Sorry, love and so I'm a Polly Pocket. <laughs> this is my fit and adorable. Then, wait, I have to somehow show the shoes. Wait, we can get a cute little picture. Like, <laughs> oh. love it. So oh, no. these are these are our Thursday Halloween costume. This is my first Halloween costume. Is this your first Halloween costume of Ever. the year? Yes. Ever. Ever. We all don't really go together, but I think it's fine. Yeah, we don't. We are like the complete opposite. I'm all black, and you are so <laughs> colorful. And you're right in the middle. And I'm a hundred-year-old man. <laughs> 
happy Friday. Today, I literally did nothing. I laid in bed. I watched One Tree Hill. It was a great day. I've gotten like no sleep this week. I've been so incredibly busy with work, with school, social life, with Halloween, with everything. I just really needed a day to myself. But now it's like 8.30. I'm drinking an iced coffee because I have a little party to go to tonight. My friend is throwing a fall fest. That's what she's calling it. So I'm going to show y'all the fit. If y'all saw my what I'm wearing this fall video, this is my flannel that I got. It's from Princess Polly. Actually, my whole fit is Princess Polly today, so Emily in 20% off. This flannel, I got it in a size 6, and for some reason, it's just really, really oversized. So I'm actually wearing it as a dress. So yeah, this is the flannel, but I don't know, I kind of like it as a dress. I definitely do have shorts on underneath because there are like slits on the side, but I think it'll be fine. And then I really wish I had like a white headband because I have my Polly Pocket headband that I wore yesterday and I feel like this should be my new thing. Blair Waldorf who? Like this would be so cute. But I just don't think the pink flowers match the fall vibe. And this might be all the footage you get for today. Sorry about that. Oh, nope. Actually, I got a fun little package today. Let me show you. I got a package from Basin. They sent me their Villains bath bomb collection. How cool is this? It says something wicked this way comes. This is so cool. Oh, it smells so good. These are my favorite packages to get. Thank you so much, Basin. My outfit is giving me very much like hook 'em horns, like UT vibes, and that makes me kind of happy because both my parents went to UT. In another life, I would have gone to UT and I would have studied engineering, probably architecture, just like my dad. And then I would have met a really handsome, nice little Texas boy. We would have fallen in love. I probably would be married by now and then about to go into engineering. And then we would have a really big house in Texas, like in Austin. In another life, that's what I would be doing. Okay, I should probably go. I'm kind of running late to this thing. It started at 7.30 and it's like 9.00. most of my shoes at a thrift store. Back home I got good thrift stores. Hey guys, this is Joshua Bassett, Sabrina Carpenter, the Teenage Witch. I'm Olivia Rodrigo and you're watching Disney Channel. So I'm Joshua Bassett. If you didn't know, my name is Joshua Bass and I just added the it. Can you even see that? I just added the it. Joshua Bassett once wore a green sweater tucked into black pants. So today I'm wearing a green sweater tucked into black pants. Uh, I could not find an outfit for Sabrina Carpenter because she's just not iconic. Not that famous. No, she's really not. I kind of did my own thing and I was going to be a witch, but then I found an outfit where she wears black gloves and a black headband, so hence the black headband. But also, she's like a witch, so you have Sabrina the Teenage Witch, Sabrina Carpenter. Completely Yeah, I don't know. I don't really want to wear the hat though because it doesn't really fit my head. It's like a child's hat. And I'm Olivia Rodrigo from The Good For You. I'm ready to burn down their house. Their room? I don't know which one she burns down, but one of them, probably the guys. I thought it was her room. It's probably oh. your room. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, look out, I'm gonna burn down your Look room. out? 